This video of Nancy Pelosi speaking to Mike Pence the day of the insurrection is just mind boggling. Check this out. Hi, Mr. Vice President. Hi, yeah, we're okay. We're here with Mr. Schumer, Mr. McConnell, the leadership, House and Senate. And uh, how are you? Oh my goodness, where are you? God bless you. But are you in a very safe well, that we are still not safe enough for us to go back. We're being told it could take days to clear the Capitol and that we should be moving everyone here to get the job done. Uh, we're at which has facilities for the House and the Senate to meet. We'd rather go to the Capitol and do it there, but it doesn't seem to be safe. We've gotten a very bad report about the conditions of over the um, House floor with defecation and all that kind of thing. Okay, and that calls back. Okay, I worry about you being in that Capitol, then. Uh -huh. Don't let anybody know where you are. Okay, on a not so serious note, I gotta appreciate her ability to snap into a Slim Jim while the whole world is ending. But on a more serious note, she points out the horrific defecation which the GOP calls legitimate public discourse. And she expresses a genuine concern for the safety of Mike Pence and tells him don't tell anyone where you are. But here's the part that really irks me. Pence, despite being the victim of Trump's own assassination attempt, despite the mob yelling hang Mike Pence, has gone full throttle in continued support of MAGA and Trump. What kind of psychosis do you need to suffer to defend the man who tried to assassinate you with mob violence? It's like that old saying goes, you can't wake up someone pretending to be asleep.